well, look who Harbor Freight is comparing their tools to now. I opened it up to the sliding compound miter saws, the 12 inch, and they're comparing their new Admiral one to their old Chicago electric one. Now, yeah, um, I think this is their way of phasing out the Chicago electric because why would you compare like that? Showing all the nose in that line to what it offers. Only $10 difference. But let me look around and see if they have a coupon for it. Well, here's the Chicago Electric saw. Marked down to $139.99 from the $189.99 original price. So it's 50 bucks off. And no, I did not see a coupon for their new one, the Admiral. So, yep. Yeah. So you're talking the $139.99 compared to $199.99. It depends, you know, your price point, how much you're going to use it. Um, the Admiral might be better. I don't know. You know, if you know, let me know in the comments. And I'm going to look around for uh, any reviews of it, of the new Admiral one, because I'm curious too. Well, and uh, the YouTube channel Harbor Freight Reviews has a review on it that I have been watching. And yes, it is uh, different than the Chicago Electric 12 inch. Um, has more options that you might want, like an adjust more more of an adjustable fence. Uh, the hold downs are more adjustable, things like that. So. It could be worth the 200 bucks. So, uh, you know, check it out yourself and maybe check out his review on it. See if that's worth it to you. It would be worth it to me if I already didn't have a miter saw. I have the 10 inch uh, Harbor Freight, which isn't bad. I use it every now and then. But um, check it out, see what, it, uh, what it's worth to you. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and all that jazz.